This video was sent to me by a subscriber. She asked me if I knew how to separate the gengiva from the rest of the bridge. So she can print a gengiva veneer like structure in pink to make her life easier when finishing the MMA. Here's a way to do that in ExoCAD. First step is to export the full contour. Now I need to delete merged parts and change reconstruction type to reduced because we're gonna need to reduce the gengiva part of the full arch. For that we go mark teeth. So we have the teeth marked as full contour and we're gonna paint the rest because we only want a buccal reduction of the gengiva. Reduce 1.5 Make sure that the gingiva reduction depth is at the same as this value and click apply. The reduction is done and here I try to, I just try to expose the embrasures of the teeth just so I make sure that I have no undercuts when doing the, the next step. So basically I'm trying to reveal this area where the teeth connect. Something like this. Now you go next. After everything is merged, export the reduced file. So now that we have the full contour and the reduced file, we go, we select mockup. You can select anything and press OK. Save the project and we don't need antagonist, so I'll clear the antagonist. Save and design. We bring up the reduced one. And now we need we need to choose the path of insertion of the gengiva part. So basically make sure you don't do too many undercuts. And at this stage it's important to reduce the smoothing percentage to zero so it has a better fit and click apply you're gonna have something like this go next and now when he asks you to do the box up you go to expert mode go to tools add remove mesh and you bring the box up scan bring the full contour and select yes press ok now do the box up calculation and then go to freeforming. You're going to have something like this. So basically what you have in yellow, it's going to be separated from the rest basically. And we go to free, you go to adapt and you're going to choose this tool. Now you, you see these areas, you can, you can uh, smooth them out just so you don't have anything else other than the ginger and just to give you the example, I'm going to adapt it now to see if it looks good. And as you can see, this is what remains. You see that you have a bit of tooth left over, so you can just come here and smooth it out. You can pull around, play around. Just to cover this transition. So smooth any extra bits and it should be done. So if you do your PMMAs, you should try this technique. It should be a time saver. So we go OK. And now we have the full arch in two pieces. You have the change of a part and you have the tooth part. Now if you want to do a bar for a full arch, watch this video next.